Hello folks, welcome to this video. So today we'll have a live trade execution on the gold chart on the one minute time frame. We have been following the gold chart today uh, from this low right here. We have located a Y model right here that was the reason behind this long position. Right here, when we take a copy of this Y model using the bars pattern, We'll notice right here that we have a strong self-similarity. We have right here a higher high, which is the same higher high right here. Then we have this push to the downside, same way right here, and then we'll wait for the reversal. So this was the first trade right here using this Y model. You need always to fit the reference points together the right way. And right here, you will have the entry level. Next. We'll have a long position right now on the live chart from this level. Our take a profit will be at this high. Our stop loss will be at this low. The reason behind this execution that starting another time from this low, the price was moving in this way, which is the same pattern right here. So we'll take a copy of this fractal using the bars pattern. When we scale it outside of the chart, what we can notice that right here we have a higher high, which is the same way right here, higher high. We have this curve right here, which is the same curve right here. And right here we have at the end, this triangle with a higher high, which is the same triangle right here with a higher high. So we need to scale the copy. Let me take a better one. So here from this low to this high. We'll match the reference points together. So here the low with the low. Right here the high with the high. And right here we can see that the price is matching with the chart. The copy is matching with the chart. This is our entry right here from this table. As we have mentioned before, this is our stop loss at this low right here, and our take a profit will be at this high right here. So we'll update the trade data. Thank you so much. Hello again, folks. So as you can see right here, the price hits our take a profit. Of course, we had some drawdown, but at the end, we have achieved a uh, one to five uh, point four risk to reward ratio, which is insane. Uh, the reason why we choose these lows right here because we understand very well that if the price goes and breaks these lows right here, our analysis is not valid anymore. How we get to this idea? If we go back to the copy right here or the fractal, we need a lower time frame so we can have a better visual for the details of the copy, let's say the 15 seconds or 10 seconds. We can notice that right here at the beginning of the model, we had a higher low and right here before this impulse the price didn't break this low so right here what we can understand the same way we have a higher low so the price should not break these lows okay that's why we kept our stop loss right here and this is our trade for the day so basically we have captured two important waves during the day the long position from here using the y model and another time long position right here using this fractal that we have explained a few minutes ago have a great day goodbye